Hey guys, John here, and welcome back to Stream A Day. Going to be doing some NASCAR tonight to get things started. Good lord, do I look red in the face. That's what having freaking heat stroke for two days will do to you. But, um, anyway. <laughs> yeah, so uh, welcome to uh, Bragger, Eric, Colinrad, Lime, Chaza, uh, uh, Oh, I'm forgetting somebody. Somebody from early. Early, early, early. Austin and Dale. Welcome to all of you. And yeah, I know I started a few minutes early because um, I had everything ready. So I figured I might as well. But yeah, how are you guys doing? Hope you're doing well. Uh, I'm doing better now that I have air conditioning. And I know my computer isn't going to melt, so that's good. Um, oh, frick. Here, there we go. No. Eh. What is that saying to me? The live event is over. What are you talking about? Why does it do this to me? Oh, it changed my URL. What? All right, hold on. It changed the URL on me for the chat box. I shall fix it right now. We're doing it live, people! I don't know why I did that, but okay. Should be fine now. There we go. I don't know what the frick. YouTube, what the frick. No, 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 Colin Rad, it's fine. We're fine. <laughs> you don't have to go. It's fine. Stay. Stay. He's fixed. Okay, Lime, if you would prefer that, I will refer to you as Don, if that's what you prefer. But yep, doing it live! That's what we do around here. It's, as Avidya said one time, it's not a stream until everything breaks. <laughs> but uh, anyway, um, so yeah, we are going to be getting started here. Let me go ahead and switch over to... Uh, oh, yeah, I need to grab my... Uh, their headset too so that I can hear the game it was incredibly loud Janier welcome to the wolf pack thank you for the follow and otaku Anthony welcome to the wolf pack thank you for the follow Follow train! Follow train hype! NASCAR fan, how you doing? Colorado's back to Twitch. Everything's right with the world, I guess. Um, let's see if I... Oh, I'm gonna have to fix this too. Okay. Oop. Um, okay, that's fine, but I have to fix the YouTube chat again because things... I bet they're gonna make me do this every freaking time now, aren't they? Fixed and fixed. All right, cool. We good. We good. Everything seems good. Uh, yes, Don. That is the plan. In order to uh, to be able to do it at release, though, that's why I have my donation thing set up so that people can donate towards getting it early. But eventually, I will have Master Heat Evolution, and the plan is to do streams and videos. Um, so, yeah, it'll be like a career mode LP, and then occasional streams with random races and if there's challenges or whatever else there is. Step like that. Oh, I did, didn't I? You're right, Colin Red. I had it ready. I had the even. I had. <laughs> I had Twitter open. I had the thing copied, and I didn't hit tweet, because I'm garbage. I am utter garbage. I'm also doing this a lot, apparently. Because, you know, why not? But yes, uh, thank you. You pointed out that it was a number. <laughs> Is <laughs> John's dying? Number 75. That's 75 freaking streams in a row, guys. How freaking cool is that? Alright. 
streams tweeted. What would I do without you? Good lord, I don't know. I don't know. It's tempting to find out. Anyway. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna skip the demo, Austin. I was trying to fix my uh, Twitter thing. Been subscribed for four years. Wow. That is quite a while. Thanks for hanging in for so long. Uh, but yeah, you only missed one, the inaugural one. Nice. Yeah, rip me, all right. All right, so let me know as we do this if the audio is good and all that. It should be fine. I think it'll be fine. All right, so uh, as some of you know, I do a career mode LP of this. There'll be another episode of that tomorrow. It goes up every Saturday. But tonight, I'm going to be uh, messing around with the... Where is it? Uh, some of the lightning challenges, first of all, and then maybe some random races as well. So let's do a regular race first just to get things rolling because I had a request. Yeah, there we go. Austin repeated his request. Jeff Gordon. I don't... Do I have that unlocked? I should. Oh, wait. No, it's a different memory, memory card. I may not have that. I may not have that. Yeah. Unfortunately... Everything's locked because I had to use a new memory card to start a new career mode. Sorry. Uh, I can do the Looney Tunes car or the regular DuPont. Which will it be? <laughs> Looney Tunes or DuPont? Let me know. Kurt Busch at Daytona or Talladega. I could do that. You still count the 15 second stream? I mean, there were a few of those actually, Colin Red, but it does count because you did make an appearance. So. Regular DuPont at Darlington. Okay. Got it. Do, 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 do. Oh, I need to actually double check what my settings are here. Uh, let's do 10%. Yeah, we'll do a 10 percenter. Image limited. Yeah, that should be good. And then we want the AI. Uh, we'll go with medium for now. See how that goes. Third car to the left. Uh, Pick the John Cena car. I don't think that exists. But anyway, all right, so Darlington. Don't have Darlington tonight, but you just said Darlington, so we'll, we'll be good. We'll be good there. All right, cool. Mr. McBlam, welcome to the stream, and thank you. I appreciate it. But welcome indeed. Um, <laughs> you just give me all kinds of orders. I will. I will do what I want to do. With the we'll see how this first race goes. But uh, yeah, guys, let me know again if the audio is balanced good. If the game's too loud or too quiet, if the music's too loud or too quiet, or if I'm too loud or too quiet. All those good things. All right, uh, I'm not going to qualify. I'm just going to start mid-pack, and we're going to go from this there. This is Joe Moore along with Barney Hall for MRN. All right, so there's Rusty and Bobby on the front row. And I'm going to be starting in the middle of the field. Oh! Newman did not get going there. We made contact with him to start things off. That's that's the thing that happened. All right. They're like I heard like fireworks going off, but it's not a holiday. <laughs> Don't know what that was. Work our way through the field here. And let's see. We're probably pitting around lap 15 or 16, I assume. It's past halfway. Makes the most sense. We'll see. Depends. There could be a caution or something. Yeah, that always happens. You're right. It does. Oh, okay. Kill my momentum there, buddy. Let's 
race on the bottom at Darlington? Well, that's what I'm trying to do. I'm not going to go all the way fully on the apron every time. I can use it to like cut in and get underneath somebody, but the car is pretty tight. I, I didn't even think about messing with the setup, so we might want to adjust that a little bit on the pit stop because it's pretty tight, to be quite honest. Uh, props came after you, bragger. Oh, God. Yeah, this car is really, really tight. Oh, God. Oh, we got a little Darlington stripe on it. We're going to make this pass on the outside of Biffle and cut underneath Mark coming off onto the straightaway. That was interesting. That worked... Way better than I thought it was going to. Oh boy, breaking news. Here we go. Stupid fast in 3 and 4. That's true. I remember that being a thing. Even like in career mode, if you get your setup right, you... Uh... Oh god. <laughs> okay, that was not good. Uh, if you get your setup right, you can usually gain a ton of time. 3 and 4 if you're smart. Can you do a race with Casey Kane? Uh, sure. Yeah, he's in this game. He's a rookie, driving, actually they've got him driving the Bush Series car he was driving at the time, the 98 channel lock car. Oh god, I was looking at chat. Colin Red's story was too interesting. Excuse me, teammate. Oh, we went deep on that one. That's crazy though, Colin Red. Hopefully uh, nothing too terrible was going on. It is a really good scheme, Austin, you're right. Um, unfortunately, like I said, when I, I wanted to do a new career, so I wanted to make sure I had plenty of slots for stuff, and uh, so I used a different memory card. My, my other memory card, my original memory card for the game, uh, I had all of the paint schemes unlocked, but uh, I'd have to go fishing around to find it. <laughs> I uh, probably won't tonight, but maybe in the future I'll dig that old one out just so I can show off everything that I, that's unlocked. Tony Stewart at Dover. You just you love to see me drive at Dover, don't you, Chaza? Watch me suffer. Cause I won't do as well as I did in 07, that's for sure. I usually struggle at Dover. So we've definitely plateaued a bit here. We're not catching these guys nearly as fast as we were as our tires wear. Actually, let's look, go ahead and look at our pit options just to get that out of the way. Let's go no on that. Let's free it up one turn and let's lower that tire pressure a couple notches so we get some more grip. Okay. Now I'm feeling a little more confident about that setup. Uh, looks like we could go about 12 more laps, but I probably won't go that many. I'd say... Nine or ten more. Ah, I got a little uh, squirrel there. Oh, Todd Burdon blew up. Oh, oh yeah, I'm getting really tight. I keep getting another Darlington stripe almost every time through there. Casey Kane announced that, or that's a rumor. Because. Oh, 21 or 22? Okay. Ooh, we got a run. Oh, little contact with Junior there. All right, I can change it to 21. I'll take your advice, Mr. McBlam. You know better than me. Uh, favorite car in this game by each manufacturer in the game. Wow. Um... You know what? To be honest, I agree with most of what you said there, Austin. Um, <laughs> yeah, Dover's the worst. Um, yeah, all of those that you mentioned are really, really cool. Uh, I'm drawing a blank, to be honest, on the ones that I would normally say. Oh, the, um, the Halloween Home Depot number 20 because Tony Stewart's my favorite driver 
and I really thought the black paint scheme on that was really cool. Um, so that was one that I always remember. And uh, I don't think who else. Hmm. No. Oh, it's so tight. We might actually drive up to the lead here before we have to pit. That'd be cool. KC at, at Michigan? Sure. I might I get to the lightning challenges if you guys keep requesting uh, races. That might be all, all we get done. <laughs> uh. Two years, you think Junior's going to leave? Uh, I mean, unless his health problems continue. I think he'll probably hang in there a little longer than that. And Casey, I don't know. It definitely hasn't worked out for him going to Hendrick, let's be honest about it. Not what he was hoping for. Uh, this is on the medium difficult. Oh god! Oh, Rusty jumped sideways, almost took us out. Whoa, that brought out the conscience. That's gonna mean we're gonna be pitting. Oh. Oh, we're gonna... We might lap a few people here, but this... Most of them, I think, are gonna get saved by the caution. No, actually, they got trapped behind the pace car, so they're lapped anyway. Ha <laughs> ha! But, um... I really gotta get a fan mail. <sighs> One of these days, dude, like, after I move again, I will. But for now, it's just... It's, yeah, I, I, I wouldn't have easy access to, like, a P.O. box or anything. Is that what he did? He blew a tire. Something. He jumped freaking sideways and about killed us. <laughs> you see what he did to our back end of our car? He clipped us. Uh, yeah, I'm def I definitely pitting on the caution because uh, otherwise we would have been in trouble. Drive my car from career mode. Um... I could make a, a custom car just just for fun tonight too. The thing is, if uh, Mark doesn't show up, I'll probably just do this game tonight. It's just if Mark shows up, then uh, then we might do some stuff other than this. But if not, we might just stick with this for a while and do all kinds of stuff. Who knows? Uh, all these people in front of us we kept the lead though, so that's good. Um, when do I plan on moving? That is completely unclear. Oh, hey. Well, that gave us a little gap. <laughs> Got into Kyle pointing. Um, that's completely unclear at this time. I don't really have a timetable. I just mean that someday I would like to have easier access to a P.O. box or something. But, uh, we'll see. We'll see. Um... can do prank videos. I don't I don't know what that means. I'm I'm worried about what that would mean. You're gonna send me stuff so I can do prank videos. Sounds terrifying. Also, I think I was better before I made the changes to my setup because these guys are breathing all down my neck right now. Car's handling better, but I feel like it's slower too. That or they've just picked up the intensity levels here. Maybe yeah, maybe once I get a few laps on the tires, it'll it'll even out for me. Because right now it's it's the, oh god oh, oh contact and they're just beating me up right now. <laughs> Twitch was killing your battery. I don't have easy access to a P.O. box, and I don't want to just give my address where I actually live out to the internet, Colin Rad, because that's dangerous. <laughs> As you've seen from some people that have dropped by chat once or twice, there's some really terrible people who would like to probably send me poison in the mail or something. You know? So I don't intend to share my home address. That would be not good. I don't need anthrax in the mouth. Alright. Yeah, I feel like the change to change the setup was bad for me. I am just way slower than I was before. I feel or they're just way faster, I don't know which. But um, 
it's going to be interesting. Well, that's what I said. I, I just don't have easy access to something like that right now. So, therefore, my only other choice would be home delivery, which would suck. Soon, no, not right now, but maybe in the future. Yeah, it did have a lot of uh, great ones. And yeah, I saw that uh, Lime, or Don, sorry. I forgot you. It's me to call you Don. Um, yeah, he, uh, he's, he's, he's helping out there. I just wish Hornish would get a full time ride. That dude is so good. Like, he's. he's he showed up for what three races this year and got three top fives and a, and one of them was a win. So like, seriously, give the guy a ride. Yeah, it's it's not uh, it's not working for me though. Guess you're uh, breathing down my neck pretty heavy. Oof! Hey, uh, overdrove the corner there. That's why I went all the way up the wall. Bill Elliott. There's some irony for you. Bill Elliott racing Jeff Gordon and some would end up taking the car. There's uh, Jeremy Mayfield brought out the caution. I need to get the lead back here. Uh, oh God. <laughs> racing back to the caution. Like the good old days. All those guys get their lap back, though, or at least get to circle around. They've been. Well, I was talking about Xfinity, and he did he did okay in Cup. It wasn't all bad. Uh, welcome back, Eric. But yeah, now nah, he's not gonna do IndyCar anymore, though. Pretty sure it's he feels it's too dangerous at this point in his life. Okay, white flag. I have to hold these guys off. Get up to speed here. Car definitely went away on me after that change. But let's see. Uh, the car is actually not as tight as it was since I took a round out of it, but um, yeah, it's just, I don't know. I was getting a big run off the turn before, and then after that setup change, it's uh, a little sluggish, but it's turning okay. <clears throat> what NASCAR games do I have? Most of them. Most of them. Um... I'd say there's only a couple I don't have at this point. I even got NASCAR 2002 recently that I didn't have before. Alright, so we got that win. Oh look, we unlocked um, Darlington Knight and uh, Jeff's other paints game. Cool. Good deal. Do I have 05? I do. In fact, um, I'm going to be returning to a series I was doing on that in a couple of weeks on my second channel, uh, Channel of the Wolf Racing. Uh, if you go to my main channel page and look at the this videos on the side, you'll see um, Channel of the Wolf Racing, and that is a channel where I'm going to be doing a lot more racing games than I do on this channel. NASCAR and other things, too. Uh, all right, cool. And yeah, as I said earlier, the plan is to get Heat Evolution. Uh, I don't know if I'll be getting it right at launch because we need to um, reach a donation goal for me to be able to get it, to pre-order it, but uh, eventually, eventually. So I need to go back and look and see what everybody wanted. Let's see, Casey Kane at Michigan. Uh, Kurt Busch at Daytona. I did GTA 5 uh, in the past, Austin, and 
I just didn't really get into the game and people didn't really seem to like the videos. Um, I was going to do some of the GTA Online multiplayer uh, with my buddy Mark. We did a few videos of that. But at the end of the day, I just... I don't know. I, I feel like at this point, it's just it doesn't hold much interest for me right now. So anyway, uh, I believe the first one that was requested was Kurt Busch at Daytona or Talladega. Uh, let's see, do I have... I don't have that one, don't have that one, don't have that one. Okay, so which one do you want? Um, do you want regular Rubbermaid or Sharpie Rubbermaid? Yeah, the last uh, couple newer ones were pretty bad. <laughs> um, how long until FTB Infinity is finished? I don't know the exact number. We've recorded all of it. Uh, I haven't edited every single one of the remaining episodes, but there's still there's still quite a few to go. So yeah, it's not going to be ending anytime soon. But it has officially been recorded all the way through. Regular Sharpie, rubber man. All right. Well, Colin Red was the one who requested it, so I have to go with what he wants. Was this? Um. Oh, do the Earnhardt cheat? I will after this. I will after this. Um, so let's do... Daytona or Talladega. Let's do the Pepsi 400. Let's do it. Let's go with that. Uh, so with this setup, there's a few things that we can do. Definitely lower the tire pressure a little. Uh, we wouldn't, actually, we won't need that too much. I'm just going to leave it right around there. We definitely want to free it up. And then we can monkey around with these settings a little bit. Give ourselves some more top speed. That should probably be fine. And we'll start from mid-pack again. Tonight, it's super speedway action under the lights. MRN is live at the Daytona... Uh, Pepsi 400 has already happened. Chaz, it happens over the 4th of July weekend. Now, let's take a look at the starting line. In the front row are the Home Depot Pucks. Yeah, All right. Ready. Ready, things off here. Oops. Almost got down into Casey Atwood there right off the bat. I'm glad I figured out in my career mode, though, that you can do a little tandem drafting in this game. I really had forgotten that and thought it was something you couldn't make work, but you definitely can do some tandem drafting, so that's cool. Uh, as long as you, uh, like, if you try pushing behind somebody when they or you have somebody in front of them, then you can end up where they, like, check up and then you get into them. But if you're just, like, trying to catch the pack or something, it really is profitable to work with somebody. Does definitely seem to work better. Yeah, I uh, I lowered fourth gear and raised the, the overall so that we could. Uh, that's what I basically do. I have that that trick that I talked about where I uh, could raise the overall um, RPM basically and get a higher top speed with the, the lower fourth gear it's out pretty well uh that's not true actually colin red uh and this game is based on the 2002 roster every one of the games is based on the roster from the year before because the game is actually it comes out in the year before nascar 2003 came out into the end of 2002 so Robbie Gordon is in the uh, singular 31. Uh, the 7 at this point was still the. Uh, uh, forget the guy's name, but he sold half his team to Ray Everham or whatever. So he was kind of a teammate. Casey Edward was a kind of a teammate to Bill and Jeremy. Whoops. Yes. 
Uh, probably because they wanted to cash in on Chase Elliott, to be perfectly honest. Oh my god. That was bad. Now I'm going to have a hard time catching up. Uh, I, was, I was looking over at chat, not paying attention. Yeah, I'm never going to catch up now, so we're going to have to hope that we can catch up with, with pit stops. Jeez, that was dumb. I know, that does happen a lot, especially it seems like in career mode, but uh, it was going good until I got into him. I didn't forget the gear ratio. I did it. I did the trick. Don't you worry. Y'all just weren't paying attention. I was in my settings doing all that. Uh, but yeah. They probably just wanted to cash in on having Chase in the game. I mean, yeah, and I am starting to catch... Is that McMurray? I think that's McMurray. Well, I need to get a little closer before I can be sure. Oh, it's 27. Yeah, it's Jamie McMurray. This, this car was based on his Bush Series ride at the time. He was in this number 27 in the Bush Series. So they included him in this. Like they did, um, whatever that was earlier I was talking about, I don't remember. Alright, so I'm going to try to work with him and hopefully catch up a little bit. The hope here. We should be running faster together than we would apart, so as long as he doesn't, like, check up or anything. Oh, some people are hitting pit road. What's my favorite NASCAR game? Um, I'm gonna be honest. This one is, was my favorite for the longest time. Um, I played this game just all the time. Just like it was the one I played the most for sure. But I, I gotta say, doing my LP of NASCAR 06 definitely made me feel a lot differently towards that game. Sure, it frustrates me sometimes, but there's so much depth with all the different series and with um, the ability to, you know, utilize all your teammates, and I think McMurray's pitting, so I'm going to... Oh, okay. I thought he was dipping down there. But anyway, the ability to utilize all your teammates and all that stuff, it's definitely a great game. So, I have to say, it might sound silly to say the two that I'm doing a series on, but... Thunder 2003 and, and NASCAR 06 are probably my favorites. Bowman's not allowed to be in NASCAR games? I, I wasn't aware of that. Ooh, okay, he's probably going to hit pit road, so I'm going to stay high. Because that's going to be a bit of jumble as Kimmel causes Jeff Green to check up in front of me because Kimmel crossed up in front of me before he was fully up to speed that was great uh, you know what look at it, the fuel situ situation nine laps to go we could almost make it on fuel almost hmm how's that even possible no, that's not possible. It's burning pretty fast now, never mind. <laughs> I was going to say, it almost looked like we could make it. But I'll guarantee you that we don't need to have a full tank. No lefts, no damage, one can. Bring it up a touch. Watch and learn. Watch and learn. What's your favorite track? Uh, I mean, I'm partial to Daytona because I've been there. I've seen the racing, and it's fantastic. But, I don't know. I'm a really big fan of Richmond and Bristol. 
You know, that die-hard short track racing. Richmond's kind of the perfect track because it has elements of, of all of the stuff. But all the different kinds of tracks seem to kind of come together at Richmond, you know? But, um, yeah, I don't know. I, I Like I say, I'm, I'm kind of biased toward Daytona because I was able to be there a few times. Or... What games do I not have? You mean NASCAR games or in, in general? Because that's a much longer list. Uh, of the NASCAR games, I don't have... Uh, NASCAR 2001 and I don't have I'm gonna pit next time but I don't worry uh, I don't have what is the other one I was thinking of oh yeah like those weird ones like um, NASCAR what is it the kart racing one NASCAR Unleashed or NASCAR Rumble or whatever the frick it was um What else? I've got 99 and 2000 on the N64. I had NASCAR 2000 on the PC. Uh, I've got Thunder 2002 and 2003. Got the NASCAR Racing 2003. I feel like I've got all of them except like the weird ones and like NASCAR 2001. Stay down. But yeah, currently failing Spanish. I thought you said you were doing well in Spanish. What are you? What are you doing here? All right, see you later, Eric. Have a good one. Um, yeah, the AI was pretty bad in NASCAR 15, but I feel like it was even worse in games that came out before it. Go go go! Okay. Hopefully, this will make up for how much time I probably lost coming on to pit road. I'm going to try to get up to speed faster than Kins is here. Holy crap, Jeff Gordon. Jeez, dude. Did not see him until it was too late. Alright, we're going to have to try to draft with Kins. It's going to be our only saving grace for getting up to speed here and catching Jeff up there. Pretty sure Jeff's going to cycle around to the lead. Oh right, I didn't have uh, NASCAR 14 because I did. I decided just to not bother. I was gonna get it on the Steam if it went on sale, and then they actually removed it from Steam, so you can't even get it on there. Oh, caution! That's cruddy. Wait, why didn't it? Oh, we already crossed the line. Dang! So all those guys that were coming off pit road are gonna be ahead of us. Dang, that was a terrible crash. Wimmer and uh, Sterling Marlin on fire through the grass there. Um, oh, no, I'm not kidding. Yeah, it's true, but Kurt has definitely changed. Oh, we're not going to win. I realized it was down to the white flat. Yeah, we got smurfed. That's, that's not fair. Oh, well. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, welcome Taco. Um, I don't know how you forgot stream a day was a thing when it's literally every day and it has been for 75 days now, but okay. What if we could get a top 10 still here? Let's try. Yeah, what Taco said. If we get the donation goal, I'll pre order it. If we don't, I'll just be getting it sometime after release, whenever we can. I think there will be a change in NASCAR 2003. What do you mean? Eh, couldn't get underneath him, but we ended up 10th. Oh, well. We got smurfed on that caution. Letting those guys come off pit road ahead of us, that wasn't really fair, but whatever. Uh oh. That's the way it goes. An update? Um, no. <laughs> They're not going to update 
They're not gonna update NASCAR 2003. You forgot because you're not here anymore. You've missed like one stream. Uh, anyway. Uh, Taco, if you can hang around, Mark might be showing up. So that's something for you to be happy about. All right, well, sorry I didn't get a win as Kurt Busch. I tried, but we got cheated. Not cheated. It was a terrible crash that shook things up on the people pitting, but whatever. All right, now... Oh, you wanted me to do the... The trick with Dale Earnhardt, right? Now, I think the way this works is that I put his name in here... And then it's going to go, wow, and it's going to give me Dale Earnhardt to drive as, right? Wow. Yeah, there we go. Wow. All right. I think you can also do that for other people, but I'm not going to mess with it right now. So there's Dale Earnhardt. We have him now. I'll show him. There you go. Uh, but I'm supposed to do Casey Kane at Michigan. Oh, where's Casey Kane? Oh, why did it save that? That's so dumb. Where's Casey Kane? Did I miss him? Oh, no, I have to unlock him, too. I can't do Casey Kane. Crap. Anyway, I don't think EA would ever want to anyway at this point. You have a similar sense of humor. Yeah, sure. Um, so I was sorry I can't do Casey Kane at Michigan because I don't have him unlocked. I think it was Jay Nair who asked for that. So if you want to see somebody else, let me know. Yeah, but he was in this game in his Bush Series car. Um, anyway, so the next request I see is Don saying Dale Sr. at Richmond. So let's just do that and then Jay Nair can tell me who he wants as his replacement. So Richmond it is. I just don't see that particularly, Taco. Um, but I mean, I guess if you see the similarities, that's cool. I I don't, I don't really see that myself, but it's just me. All right, let's drop you down here. Um, Frank Kimmel was basically funding his own deal, trying to make it work, and it just didn't work out because he ran terrible every week, so he went back to Arthur where he could dominate at least for a few more years. Yeah, well, I act like that's a bad thing. Cody Stewart at Homestead. Dale Sr. at Michigan. Well, I'm doing Dale Sr. right now. So maybe somebody else. I'm looking like 20. And then free this thing up a bit. Boop, 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 boop. And we'll go with this for now and see what we get. MRN comes to Richmond, Virginia for tonight's race, the Chevy Monte Carlo. Yeah, you actually have to unlock him. Um, he's one of the licensed things that you unlock. Apparently, anyway. I know he's in the race, but I can't actually drive as him yet. Who <laughs> wants to watch John stream? Frick that guy. Well, I'm glad you uh, changed your mind. Also, since I'm driving as Dale Sr., I'm just going to run people over if they get in my way, because that's what he would do. Whoop. See? Don't even care. Frick you too, Kurt Busch. Use me, Schrader. This is actually the GameCube version, but yeah. I, th I feel like you had to unlock all of the uh, uh, guys that were considered additional, basically. Just ramming my way through through the field here. I probably should have raised the difficulty for this race since I'm always really good at Richmond. 
This is looking a little too easy. To be fair. You got a notification on the video from five years ago. Yeah. Fantasy track with Terry Labonte. Um, yeah, I don't actually know. I would have to unlock the fantasy tracks to remember. I don't have anything unlocked, so I probably can't do that. Yeah, he's the main reason they added the Intimidator button. It's all, all in homage. Dennis Senior. What do you mean finish SWB? There is no finishing Star Wars Battlefront. It doesn't end. It's just a multiplayer game. It doesn't have a plot. Um, Batman Arkham City will be back soon. I just needed a little break from it because the last session of it really frustrated me. Um, so, yeah. It'll be back, though. I'll, I'll finish it one of these days. I'm like three quarters of the way through it, according to Taco. Oh, really? Okay. Well, I'll, I'll have a look. Jeff Gordon, he's, he's fighting me here. Don't want to give up this lead. Come on. Eh. Oh, caught a piece of the fence there. Car is very tight now all of a sudden. Not even that far into the, the run here. Can we make this pass on the high side? Maybe. It's gonna be hard though. Ugh. Come on. Come on, I really want to make this pass on the high side. Oh no. Well, that was bad. That was real bad. <laughs> <laughs> Richmond, yes. I guess it is kind of that way, but if you run into the wall and freaking damage your car that bad, it kind of works. Only overtake on the outside challenge. I used to do that sometimes, but... I told you before, Taco, just skip Ocarina of Time. Just watch me play my uh, Master Quest playthrough and... We can go back to playing Wind Waker HD. It's a much better game. Our Queen of Time is it's not that amazing. It's, it's a frustrating to control game with very dated graphics. It sometimes can be annoying as well. It has charm and it has a great story, but I don't know. I mean, I am Dale Senior, so wrecking him to win would make sense. But I think I can, I think I can hold him off. I'll get out in front here. Plus, we have to pit fairly soon. There's that. Oh, that's cool, Colin. Right? I hope you enjoy it. It's a pretty fun game, but it can be pretty frustrating in online multiplayer, for sure. Well, then don't watch me play it. I don't freaking care. But all I'm saying is don't play it. Because if you don't like something, you don't have to freaking play it. You can read the freaking story on Wikipedia or something and then move on to the next game. Actually, don't move on to the next game because Majora's Mask is even worse. So, 
like I said, just go to Wind Waker HD and enjoy the best Zelda game. Is there a NASCAR bounce? Not really. Uh, I can always do the John bounce though. As I wrecked the car because I wasn't paying attention because I was doing the John bounce. <laughs> right. Are you happy? Uh, this car is so tight right now. Let's um, let's definitely make some adjustments. Yes, yes, no. Do do it. No, not that much. Uh, one. And give ourselves some more grip. Yeah, it's crazy with Chris Buescher. Um What a what a career changing moment that rain was, because he. Uh, yeah, <laughs> it's it's crazy. It's it's gonna change everything for him because even if he does terrible from here on out, he's going to have made the chase. That statistic will not go away. I'm just gonna come to pit road. Okay. Car was out of control. How do you zoom into your screen when you do NASCAR 06 videos? What do you mean? Zoom into the screen. I just realized that this is cropped wrong, isn't it? I didn't see that that was cropped wrong. You guys should have told me. that it was dropped wrong, eh. <laughs> I forgot that I needed to pause it and I'm over here fiddling with my freaking setup. Ah, oh, that's annoying. That's so annoying. I thought I paused it. Oh, capture the game only. Um, I mean... That's just how the capture card works. It sends the, the what's coming out of the back of the console goes into the capture card, and that goes to my recording program where I can crop and do things. But clearly, I had that cropped wrong. Uh, well, we just got wrecked. Uh, what a mess. Dale Jr. at Michigan will do. I played Metroid or Kirby. Um, yes, I have some of them. Uh, good lord, my car is a mess. But I'm not gonna pit because, yeah. Oh, are we a lap down? Frick! I bet we are. No, we're a lap down, which means I have to get up here, pass the leader, and freaking bring a caution out. Let's go. Let's go do it. We gotta do it fast though, because laps are gonna wind down quick. Anyway, um, favorite Metroid game is Metroid Fusion, the Game Boy Advance game. In my opinion, it is the best uh, Metroid game. But that's my opinion. Most people would disagree. Um, I'm being way too aggressive here. It's not helping me. Uh,. But, you know, people swear by, like, the Prime games. Um, I think I'd much rather play the Prime games on the GameCube because I got the, the trilogy remade for Wii, and I hate the Wii controls for that game. It's so annoying. But, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Get up here and get past the leader and bring out a caution before too many more laps go by. We might be okay. I don't know who the leader is though exactly. Guess we'll find out. It's whoever we don't gain a position on there. Oh, crap. Stop looking at the chat, John. Play the freaking game. Yeah, you just have to make sure that you're uh 
the capture card is a, a decent one. Uh, obviously, mine is pricey for somebody that's just starting out, but um, I use the Elgato HD60 Pro. Um, but yeah, there's definitely alternatives. Sure. Okay, I'm trying to figure this out. I'm in front of the leader, I think. I think the leader is Labani. Which means that I can now bring out a caution. And I missed. I was... Oh, there's the caution. No. No, uh-uh. Uh-uh, I want my lap back. Okay, we got our lap back. There's not going to be many laps left, though. Yeah, you can't you can't do that though, Taco. Not for Metroid Prime. It would be nice if you could, but you can't. You can only do that on certain games. All right, so we only have like four laps left. Frick my life. But at least we're on the lead lap. Ah, uh, if I can get ah. Uh, yeah, we're not winning. I swear, I. Thought we were gonna just dominate in this race, but nope. If I could get a good set of turns up here, though, maybe. We just have to get under these guys and, s and gain some time here. Uh, oh boy. You know what? Maybe we're not done just yet. We gotta go fast, though, here. Oh, frick. I hadn't clipped that stupid inside guy. Okay. Maybe up to third. We got a chance at this, guys. We got a chance at this. A slim one, but a chance. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on, let's get this beat up piece of crap car in here. Oh! Careful. Not happening, buddy. <laughs> uh, we won. <laughs> Crazy. Ah. Uh. All right, let's see. I do have Donkey Kong 64. I do indeed. But, uh... Kids getting in free. Huh, that's nice. Might encourage some. Oh, um... Curry. Uh, well... I'm trying to think. I played one of the really old Kirby's. Adventures in Dreamland or something like that. It's okay. Um, not my favorite. And then there's that one that's like golf. I can't remember what that one's called, but it's fun. And then I played Kirby 64 on stream one night, which I think you were here for. And I like that game. It's pretty fun. But Kirby games on the whole have just never really been my cup of tea. Strap down the big TV. What does that even mean? I didn't even say that. <laughs> Why are you trying to add something I didn't say? <laughs> what does that even mean? Anyway, we won. That's all that matters. Let's move on. Doing Dale Jr. at Michigan. Yes, Jr. requested Dale Jr. at Michigan. And he was owed the last one, but unfortunately I didn't have Casey Kane. So there you go. Uh, yeah, sure. Go ahead, save. I don't really care. But okay. Speaking of that, just for the sake of argument. Oh, Tiburon is here. That's that's one of the fantasy tracks. I think that's the only one I have, though. Well, I. The Vegas road. No, the Vegas road course wasn't a thing yet, so. Or no, it's Phoenix Road Course, that's right. Yeah, I don't have that unlocked, though. 
But I do have Tiburon. I hate Tiburon, but I, I, I'll race there later if you want me to. For now, though, we're doing um, Michigan. I, I did not say the Walter quote. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, they've already hired Clint Boyer to replace him, Chaza. And the whole team's switching to Ford, which is odd, but that's happening. Alright, tire pressure can go down. The notches. Free it up a little bit. Boop, 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 boop. Should be good. Here we go. Welcome everyone to Michigan International NX launch title predictions. Obviously Zelda Breath of the Wild, which is basically I mean it's coming out on Wii U too, so even though it's gonna be awesome, I don't think it's going to be like as advanced as people want it to be on the NX, but we'll see. Um They're talking about porting Smash Brothers and Splatoon. Um I'd love to see them announce a new Mario Kart at the same time, or maybe an updated port of the one we have, but I don't think that's going to happen for a while. So at launch, it's probably going to be Zelda, Smash Brothers, Splatoon, and, um, oh god, <laughs> and, um, they have said that there's going to be a Mario game and a Pokemon game within the first six months of it being released, so I guess that's technically still a launch title. Um, so my guess is... I'd love to think it's the long-awaited Mario Galaxy 3. I doubt it, though. It'll probably be, like, a 3D World type of game. Um, and then Pokemon... They're getting the actual team that does the Pokemon games to make it, which is the first console game that they've either ever made or they've made in a really long time. So my guess is it's probably going to be Pokemon Stadium-esque. Uh, similar to that, so yeah. That'll be interesting to see, I guess, but um, who knows, really. Kind of casually working our way to the front here. I almost feel like I probably should have raised the difficulty, but eh, it's fine. Number 20, uh -huh. See you, Bragger. Have a good one. Thanks for hanging out. Uh, Diddy Kong Racing is basically almost done. I have to be the final boss, and that unlocks some new tracks to try out for extra challenge, and then you can, like, unlock another character or something. So it's possible that I could finish that in one or two more streams. I don't know. But the problem is I don't know if I can even beat the final boss because it's ridiculously hard. Um, but we'll see. Mario 3D World, I'm nowhere near the end. Nowhere near. Uh, oh god. Oh god. Um. I mean, so far, Lime or, or Don, from what I've seen of how you are in chat, you seem very nice. Sure. Uh, Dirt to Daytona is not going to come back as a Twitch series. Dirt to Daytona is on the shelf for a reason because it frustrated the crap out of me and I don't want to play it right now. It'll come back when I'm over being frustrated at it. <laughs> you should do it just like a couple sentences at a time, Taco. Also, why are you watching on YouTube tonight? Odd. Um, what console is it on? It is on the N64. Or the DS. They made a version of it for DS, but it has some differences that, uh, like they removed certain characters that they no longer had the licensing rights to. But yeah, it's on. It's uh, it was originally a Nintendo 64 game, 
And unfortunately, they don't have it available for Virtual Console or anything like that. So the only way you can really play it if you don't have that is um, an emulator. But obviously, I don't encourage that locally because Twitch might frown on that. But yeah. I mean, another Metroid game would make sense, although they're they're doing that freaking Federation tricked up force or whatever the frick it's called, um, which I don't think anybody really is really happy about. Um, so in reality, Donkey Kong is probably more likely. I just don't know if Tropical Freezer is enough of a commercial success for them to push for that just yet. Unless they're going to do a completely different type of game. Uh, sort of reinvent it, or maybe do like a Donkey Kongo where you use the detachable controller things that are going to be on the NX to um, play the air bongos or something stupid like that, but who knows. It's jumping for you, NASCAR fan? Try the YouTube side. When people have issues, it's usually because their internet just doesn't get along with Twitch. And if you go over to the YouTube side, you can uh, adjust the quality until it works a little better for you. Uh, maybe. Maybe, Taco. Oh, God. Yes, my tires have gone away. This car has started to handle pretty poorly, and these guys have been all over me. I would love to see them do that for Mario Kart 8. Like, I know they're going to do it for Smash and Splatoon. That's almost guaranteed. Um, I'd love to see them do it for Mario Kart 8. And like you say, with all the DLC in, because frick the cost of the DLC on some of that stuff with Smash Brothers. Oh, I didn't um, set up my pit options. Uh, I think I need to free it up a little more. I need to go back up on this for the top speed, and I missed the entrance to pit road. Man, freaking tastic! Why did I pause when I did? Like I just jumped down there and then hit the pause button. That was dumb. Do I watch any other sports? Uh, I do when I can. Um, mainly all I really have time to watch is NASCAR and if you count it, WWE. Um, but yeah, I mean I keep up with like football and basketball and stuff, but I don't like really religiously watch it. I just don't have the time. Uh, I usually am doing YouTube stuff like 14 hours a day. So it's, um, it's tough have time. Okay, I stopped too much there. Frick me, where's this stupid line? Alright, I'm gonna have to say no on the left tires now, because I'll never catch up if I do four tires, so this will probably be terrifying. Did I see what you said about Pikmin? I don't think so. Let me go back up. Pikmin 4 and Galaxy 3 have been confirmed in development, but I don't think it'll be early. Yeah, they're not going to be at launch for sure. I don't see that possible. But I'm glad the Galaxy 3 is going to happen because I love the Galaxy games. But yeah. Jimmy Johnson at Texas. Sure, we can do that. F-Zero would be fantastic, though. I don't know why they don't see that, but... On the flip side, we were all so excited about them making a new Star Fox game, and then it was Star Fox Zero. <laughs> I mean, I like Star Fox Zero. I will play it again to try to unlock the hard path and all that. But it's not what we wanted in a Star Fox game. Let's be honest about it. It is not what we wanted. Yeah, man. Mario Galaxy and Mario Galaxy 2 are fantastic freaking games. Alright. 
these guys are out in front of me, even with what I, my pit stop strategy, but of course I lost a ton of time to them with uh, missing pit road. I just have to hope that my tires don't wear out so bad that I can't make any ground up on them, because like, man, whoever that is is way out in front up there. Ugh. Also, the leader is he's finally pitting. I was going to say, he's taking his freaking time. It wasn't the pit stop. I missed the entrance to pit road the first time by because I braked too late. Oh my gosh, Colin Red, do you want me to just play like 700 things at once? <laughs> I'm working on trying to make progress in Sly 2, but I had to have this whole Minecraft thing I've been trying to catch up on. I had a setback with Infinity, so that's why I had two episodes yesterday. So I'm trying to get Terror Sword caught up. And then finally, um, I can start focusing on everything else. Slide 2, I'm like halfway through the game or thereabouts, and I should be able to pick up some speed and breeze through that game, because I know it so well. Um, slide 3 will start sometime after that. Um, well, uh, Mr. McLam, I think he's referring to uh, me playing HD. Wow. You know what, Colin Red? Usually I brush off what you say, but that that's pretty that's pretty annoying. You know I was going through a really rough time when I did that, so that's that's kind of irksome that you would say that. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, if they do a new control scheme like thing, like motion control crap, I will not play an F Zero game like that. It's just dumb, it's stupid. I don't know why they think gimmicks are what people want. The only people that want gimmicks are people that have never played video games before. Most gamers just want regular controls, just a nice controller to play the game with. But yeah, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But yeah, I do want to like do Kingdom Hearts HD 1.5 and 2.5 at some point. Well, I did do a video that explained why I was taking the break originally, and it was because I was going through a hard time with the copyright strike and bad times in general. But anyway, that's in the past. Now we're in the future. Or the future? The present. We're not in the future. Uh, no, Benjamin. Or, wait, yeah, I am. I'm, well, the stream is running at 60 FPS. The game only runs at 30 FPS, and that's all it ever will do, because console games, especially ones this old, only ran at 30 FPS anyway. Some of the newer ones are 60 FPS, but most of them are not. F0 with motion controls equals Star Fox Adventures. You know what? I like Star Fox Adventures, so... To be honest, if it was as good as that, I might enjoy it. But that had didn't even have motion control, so... Unless you meant zero, I don't get to compare. Um, I don't know what you mean. If you're talking about the race that's on tonight... Or no, it's tomorrow. That's right. The races are tomorrow. Obviously, I don't have an opinion because they haven't happened yet. I am looking forward to them. I do. You're right. But it's because... Um, honestly, I probably don't need it here. But where, wherever I was at the beginning, Darlington or whatever, I can't, I can't run that place without auto brake. All I ever do is just crash straight into the wall. I can never brake enough. But I don't think it's making me that slow, to be honest. I'm catching these guys. We're getting there. And NASCAR game with motion controls. Uh, well, they did have one of the games was on Wii, and you used the remote, right? I think. I could be wrong about that. I feel like that was a thing. Oh, pushed up. Okay. Got to run these guys down. I mean, it was weird and 
obviously it was never intended to be a Star Fox game. They just kind of tacked in the characters and the flying sections to make it a Star Fox game, but I liked it for what it was, like exploring and unlocking stuff and the fighting, all of that it was actually pretty fun. It can be frustrating, but I think it's a pretty good game, all things considered. Um, man, I I feel like I could have made something happen here, but the car was just too tight, and the old tires on the left-hand side, I just can't get the grip. Yeah, I just lost third. Oh, well. I don't even care anymore, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, getting hand cramps when I'm gonna actually... The car was so freaking tight at the end there. Star Fox 64 is amazing, and it is my favorite game of all time. Rusty Wallace at the Fantasy Track Tiburon? Sure. I think that's the one you mean. It's the only one I have unlocked anyway, so. Sure, we'll do that. <sighs> but anyway, yeah. Uh, Kingdom Hearts HD 1.5 and 2.5. I started both of them and then never did anything with them. <laughs> Someday I would like to, uh, I'd like to do that. I was going to do like a full run through on 2.5 especially and I recorded a bunch of it and then I lost um, the, uh, it was during the hard drive crash, I lost all the audio, it was just the video and I thought about still going with it and then I just gave up on it because it was like ton of episodes that I was ahead on, it's like nah, forget it, it's not worth it. Uh, Rusty Wallace. Do I have any other cars? We'll do the Elvis car, sure. And then let's go to Tiburon, even though this place is horrible. If you guys haven't seen Tiburon before, some of you, get ready. What a weird freaking place. What, uh, if I reach 100, I'm totally going to. It's only 25 days away. Um, yeah, I, uh... I'm looking forward to reaching 100. I don't have anything special planned, though. Um, like I said, I'll do, like, special, like, longer streams for, like, subscriber milestones, but... I mean, 100 days is an awesome milestone, but I'm not going to do anything different than I have been doing, so... Uh... Read your previous comment. I did. Oh, well, yeah, I saw the part about the motion controls and the, uh, the other vehicles. I agree with you. The other vehicles... Crap. Especially that stupid gyrocopter. That thing can die in a fire forever. But anyway. Uh, I don't even know what kind of car I set up to do for this place. It's weird. It's, like, super fast, and... Yeah, I'm not... I don't... I'm not gonna mess with it. We're just gonna race. And... Uh, Go with it. Super in Orlando, but yeah, you go the opposite direction. You go super freaking fast. Very confusing to when you're used to when you're used to going the right way around the track. It's so weird to go this way. Definitely want to try to draft here too a little bit because the top speed's crazy. I feel like it. It makes me want to turn my head weird, too. <laughs> uh, that gyrocopter is the worst thing ever invented. Oh, uh, that one level... That one level was, like, so long, too. It's like, hey, here's a new vehicle. Now spend the next freaking half hour trying to make it work. And, and go do all these stupid, boring, pointless things with it. It's like, really? You had to make me play an entire level with this stupid thing and make it this long and boring, too? Like, fuck you. But I don't know. I like the game, and I'm glad I, I played through it. Um, you know, it was a donation goal, and you guys wanted to see it, and so I gave it to you, but it, it was a frustrating game. <laughs> I'll go back to it someday on stream and, and try to 
beat the hard path, but it's... I don't know when I'll be doing it. <laughs> That's one I don't know how much I'm looking forward to doing it, to be honest. I'm not really gaining any ground here. It's gotta be admitted. Um, did, did he? No, 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 I, I did a regular video of that. I didn't lose the audio on that one. I only lost the audio from Macbeth onward or whatever. When I did the stream night. Everything before that was, was, record, or was recorded live. I only lost the audio on the, the portion that, was, that I put on the stream. I mean, oh, 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 <laughs> how you like that dodge? Oh my gosh, that was sick. Why didn't a caution come out after that? That's crazy. Well, you weren't paying attention then because there were six episodes that were recorded live. And then I only did the, the, Remaining like three worlds or whatever on the stream I mean that part was it wasn't was it Macbeth? It was like Ficino, whatever it was like the ice world and stuff that was all Post commentated on this stream, but the first six episodes were live To be fair, I didn't play up my hatred or play up my hatred. I played down my hatred While I was recording for the most part because I didn't want to like be like hey you guys got me this game And I freaking hate it so, I, to be honest, I was pretty mild during the videos about how I felt about it, just because I didn't want to offend anybody. On the inside, I was... I was... pretty... annoyed, a, a lot of it. This track in real life would be weird. I, the guys would have to really get used to the difference and everything, but... It's also scary fast. 400 plus videos in your watch later. Wow. That's crazy, Taco. I feel like I won't have to pit. I mean, hold on. We're coming to 11 laps to go, and I have 12 and a half laps of fuel. Now, my tires are wearing out, but I won't, I won't need fuel. I wonder if they will. And they, they'll probably pit just because their tires are worn. Maybe. I don't really know. What do I use for the new NASCAR games? Um, PC for the most part. But, um, I do have NASCAR 15 on Xbox 360 and uh, Inside Line on uh, PS3. Those are of the newer ones. Now, with Heat Evolution, I don't know if I should get that for PC or console. Like, I guess if I want to do multiplayer, PC makes the most sense because I won't have to pay a monthly fee. Oh, they are pitting. But I won't have to, I don't think. I'm pretty sure I have a half a, half a lap to the good on fuel. Anyway, um, Heat Evolution, if I want to do multiplayer, I guess I'll have to do PC. Because I don't want to have to pay for a PlayStation Plus membership just to play online mode. Um, I had been t I've been thinking about getting it on PS4, but now that I think about that, I guess I'll be getting Heat Evolution on PC as well. I mean, it'll probably look the best and everything, assuming it doesn't run like crap. Also, I finally caught these guys. Go figure. Uh, I'm like tilting my head and it's hurting my, <laughs> my neck because how weirdly laid out this stupid crack is. Um, all console games nowadays, like you put the disc in, you think, oh, I'm good to go, then they still freaking download anyway. 
it's so annoying. But yeah, it is a thing that happens. If if you remove it from the list, will it save your progress? Um, I mean, hmm. It's a good question. I'm pretty sure it's separate, like from seeing it. Oh my God, he just checked up in front of me. Can't believe that didn't bring out a caution either. Also, I'm just. I just took the lead, I guess. I don't know why he slowed down so much, but okay. Also, now I'm not so sure on fuel. I feel like it burnt faster than I was expecting. I think I am going to have to stop for fuel now. Crap. What happened? We were, we, were, we were ahead on fuel. How did this happen? I mean, yeah, but then I started to think about, like, oh, what if the game is, like, um, that's the word I'm looking for. Um, whatever. If it, oh, optimized. What if it's not optimized well and it, like, lags on my PC or something stupid like that? So I, um, I started to think, well, at least PS4, I wouldn't have to worry about that. But then, yeah, with the multiplayer thing, I'm going to have to get it on PC. So, yeah. All right, well, Taco's got you there, Colin Red. Uninstalling a game will keep the save data. Okay, because I couldn't remember with the console how that worked. So, yeah. PS Plus is raising by $10 a month. Are you freaking kidding me? $10 a month? Wow. Wow. Did you hear about... Um... Just drop my controller on the floor. God dang it. Did you hear about the uh, PlayStation Now coming to PC, Taka? You'll be able to uh, use a Bluetooth dongle to use your PS4 controller and play on PlayStation Now. All the games in PlayStation Now. It's interesting. Anyway, back to the, the game here. So now it's looking like we're going to run out with two to go or something. I'm so confused. All right, well, I don't think we're going to need that much, though. Like half a can, right? Wait, no, I don't want that. Let's just do no tires and just a splash of fuel, because I'm pretty sure that's all we're going to need. Well, I use my PS4 for PlayStation now. Why do you uh, why do you have it on your PS3? Um, oh, I, I I get what you mean. You mean you'll play the the PlayStation 3 games on that instead of PlayStation Now? Got it. I don't know. I'm an idiot. Sorry. I mis misinterpreted what you meant. I asked Taco that. He he didn't answer me either. So oh, tires are very worn. That's actually troubling. If they blow, I'm going to be in trouble. So I'm going to change my left side tires because they're going to be taking the most damage. Because we're turning the opposite way. Oh, we almost sped on the pit road. I also destroyed those tires, didn't I? And I'm still going to. Frick it. As I said before, Austin, I don't have any of the special schemes. Um, the only ones for Jeff I have are his regular one and the Bugs Bunny one. That's it. I, I told you, nothing's unlocked. Oh, well, there you go. I don't know how I didn't speed. I was locked on those brakes for a year. But I got away with it somehow. Pretty fantastic. Really? Really? Man. What a benefit to the guys that pitted up there because they're not gonna... Well, actually, they might get trapped by the pace car. I don't know who's gonna end up as the leader, actually. Gonna be interesting to see. I 
I know, right? Having the pit options in the pause menu is the best thing. I, I don't know why that wasn't um, something they kept in the games. I also like being able to just pause and go through the full running order from the pause menu as well. Uh, yes, Don, that's, that was my plan is um, I'm going to do like a career mode let's play, but then on stream... I'm going to, um, oh gosh, I'm already at low fuel again, that's, oh, a white flag next time, but we should be fine, anyway, um, so yeah, I'm going to do a career mode let's play, and then I'm going to do, um, freaking, uh, what was I saying, oh yeah, like, streams where I do, like, this right here, where you guys are, like, play as so-and-so at this track, and that kind of thing. Um, so that's the idea. The, the thing I'm considering though is that the, the LP is probably going to be on the Jonathan Wolf Racing channel. Um, mainly because I know I'm not going to be anywhere near done with Thunder 2003 and NASCAR 06. And I want to keep them as the, the two games on the weekend and I don't want to overload myself with having so many games to do on the same channel with the same thing so I think the Heat Evolution career mode is probably going to be on the Jonathan Wolf Racing channel I hope I don't run out of gas oh god Arvik don't don't you dare come on I'm going to have to draft back by him come on I don't want to lose now not after all this work I didn't really work that hard, to be honest. Fuel tank's almost empty. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I think it was close there, too. Alright, come on, don't you run out of gas, you piece of crap. Don't you do it. Yeah! <laughs> awesome. Uh, oh, I want, oh, you're right, Austin. I'm sorry, you're right. I can do that then. Cool. Completely wasn't paying attention. Yeah. Yeah. I'm down for that, Mr. McBlam. Obviously, um, the chances of us having our thing in sync is going to be different because we have different ways that we uh, usually plan out our series. But yeah, I'm totally down for comparing our final finishing order or whatever. Um, in our first season of career mode. I'm down for that, yeah. Alright, let's save. And I'm feeling like one or two more of these, and then I'm probably going to call it. I don't think Mark's actually going to show up. He said he might not, because he had some stuff to do. Uh, but... Uh, what was uh, Jeff Gordon and the two hundredth Chevrolet? There we go. And then Rockingham, I think you said, uh, which is North Carolina. There it is. I wish I had the night one unlocked. I love the one at night, but uh, we'll do the pop secret version. I'm not doing Mario Kart 8. Sorry. Tony Stewart at Dover. Okay, that'll be the, the, the last one. Uh, that'll be the last one then. We'll do this race and then we'll do Tony Stewart at Dover and we'll, we'll quit. Um, Alright, car setup. Let's lower that tire pressure. Free it up a little bit. And give this a little tweak. And start the race. Another thing I like about this game too is how you, if you choose not to qualify and you start the race, they put you smack dab in the middle of the field, which is usually the perfect place for if you just want to jump in and have a race without too much trouble. Oh goodness, I did not free this car up enough. Oh, it's tight. Okay. This 
is going to be challenging. Uh, carrying in a lot of speed there. But I can't get back to the gas when I want to, and that's the worst part. Um, Rockingham is probably going to end up torn down too at this point. Andy Hillenberg bit off way more than he could chew, and now it's been forfeited back to a bank or something. They'll probably end up tearing it down. Um, Nazareth, I'm not too surprised. Um, and then, uh, so it's been a long time since it's been in play. North Wilkesboro, I think, I remember seeing it like a picture of it a few years ago and it was just like weeds growing through the track and everything so pretty sure it's not gonna ever do anything again yeah I do Austin obviously he uh, he's one of the greats of all time um, there's been times through the years when uh, I pulled for people against him just because like you know I wanted my driver Tony Stewart to beat him you know or whatever but uh, you got to have a ton of respect for Jeff and everything he's done. And then coming out of retirement to help out has been really cool to see. Especially uh, like the moments between him and Jeff, uh, him and Tony, since they get to have like their retirement together now. <laughs> it's kind of interesting. But yeah, no doubt one of the, one of the greatest of all time for sure. I don't know what he's doing. He's, he's got himself in freaking debt. I know that much. I don't know what he's doing besides that. I guess you're right about that, Mr. McBlam. Sometimes you don't want to be anywhere near these people when you're in a Utechnus game. It's like, nah, let's, let's just let them go ahead and have the whole track to themselves. <laughs> oh, you're right, Don. I'm so sorry. I, I do owe you Jimmy Johnson at Texas. And I'm pretty sure he asked before you asked, Chaza, so I guess I'm going to have to overrule that. I'm getting kind of tired, and it's been a rough few days for me anyway, so... I don't know. Wow, who is that out in front? Ticker, so... Oh, it's Dale Jr. Man, he had a big lead. See if we can run him down. Um, yeah, but I'm definitely not going to use the emulator to play it. It was glitchy and something wasn't quite right about when it on uh, when I played it on the emulator. So I'll, I'll if I do it again, I'll do it on the virtual console. That seemed to run better and uh, everything. He said Rockingham, Colin Red. Scroll up the YouTube chat. Um, pretty sure. We already did Darlington anyway, so I wasn't going to do Darlington. Anymore. Streaming F1, no. But I might do some F1 races on my new racing channel. Yeah, the AC was a rough situation. Because it's freaking... Uh, earlier today it was 97 degrees and that's the kind of I mean obviously compared to some people like Mark and where he lives in Phoenix it's that 97 is a nice cool day but for me 97 is pretty freaking hot and having no air conditioner is miserable the thing with the F1 stuff though is like, I only have F1 2012 um, I'm not sure like if that be entertaining to see uh, to see that. I mean, I do play the older NASCAR games, so I guess I, I comparison-wise, it doesn't make sense to say that. But uh, yeah, maybe I'm terrible at those games, though. So I don't know if I'd want to commit to like a series and more like one-offs, probably. Yeah, I'm a big Lewis Hamilton fan myself. Uh, pretty tight. I need to loosen the scar up more. I live in North Carolina, Austin. I did very. Don't listen to Taco. Besides, that's not a state. I live in North Carolina. Um, it is very hot here this year. Hotter than last year. Uh, oh, I 
just don't think I can pass him now. My car is so tight. I should go ahead and work on my pit setup. Uh, let's see. Thinking we go down to two, and then I give myself a little more grip. So that's what the pit stop's going to entail. I could get underneath him. Oh gosh, that's not what I meant to do. I did not expect him to slow up that much. Oh, that was bad. Sorry. Well, we took the lead though, hey. Don't complain about that. If we can keep it, that is. Good lord, it's pushed so hard. I mean... Eh, maybe it was worse last year. I don't know. Wow, he just took the right back. I guess, I guess it's it's just it seems bad when you go like two days without AC then it's like this is the worst summer ever. <laughs> uh, Americans don't hate Canada. Why would you say that? Why would you say that? Americans do not hate Canada. Canadians are like the nicest people and some of my favorite YouTubers were Canadians or, or Twitch streamers. That's right, Junior. I'm going to pass you on the high side. How you like that? Um, yeah, I'm a Panthers fan. I actually got to go to one of their games. First time I ever went to an NFL game, actually. After I moved here. And that was fun. Um... The crowd wasn't so fun, but the uh, the game itself was. It was a uh, preseason game against the uh, Patriots. Pretty interesting. Uh, well, I feel sorry for you, Taco, but I got way too used to having um, air conditioning. I went, like, most of my life without having regular air conditioning. Like a wall unit, one room. But, um, the last several years I've had central air and it changed my life. <laughs> having regulated temperature all year round is so nice. It's just, like, always 73 degrees winter and summer. So nice. Game changer. We're gonna bring it to pit road. Yeah. As long as we don't get blocked out of our pit stall with these guys pulling out. Yeah. Yep, see, it always happens, man. You get slowed down. Wow, now you're dissing on American football, Chaza? Wow. I mean, admittedly, rugby players do not have all the safety stuff that American football players have. That doesn't make them tougher, that just makes them dumber. <laughs> so much easier to get a horrible injury, like why would you do that? If you had a choice in the matter, wouldn't you have uh, a helmet on? Now as far as soccer or, you know, worldwide football is concerned, um, that's a whole different thing because they're not really allowed to ram the crap out of each other as hard as they can like they do. <laughs> Sorry, Kurt Bush. Oh god, why am I down here? The extra grip. I was just turning way more than I meant to. Hey, we came out ahead of Junior. That's good. Are we gonna inherit the lead? I think we might. Yeah, leader's pitting right now. Sweet. Worked out. And we got our lap back right there, too. Alright, car's still a little tight, but I think it's better than it was. That's good. But yet, it feels slower now. I swear, lowering that tire pressure always smurfs me over. I mean, I guess I get what you're saying, like, I do find I sleep better when it's a little cold, 
It's like I just kind of like bundle up in the covers and go to sleep, and it's nice. But, I don't know, there's something to be said for just it always being the same temperature. Look at this, he just came back and passed me because, for some reason, I was way faster last time. I go down a couple, couple pounds of pressure and all of a sudden everything's just crap. Oh. Now DJ's passing me. This is not cool. Got to rough them up, I guess. I don't want to lose this race. Pick these guys. We're not talking about what? what? We're talking about sleepwear. I wasn't talking about sleepwear at all. <laughs> Who said anything about sleepwear? Talking about whatever. It's no idea what's being said now. Um, yeah. So if I, hmm. like, I can get back by them, but then they're just right back on me, like rubber banding right back to me. It's kind of annoying. Can't pull away from them at all. I'm still tight, which isn't helping. Thank you, Dale Jarrett. Oh, ho -ho, he went right up into Junior. Well, that's going to give me a little breathing room, but then I immediately blow up my drive in the corner. But it gave me a little breathing room. See you later, Colin Rad. Have a good one. See you tomorrow. Thanks for hanging out. You were here for two hours tonight. That's that's a thing that happened. Favorite paint scheme um, this year. I don't know because, I mean, I feel like nobody should answer that question until Darlington because all those retro paint schemes look amazing. Oh, you got work to, You're working too? Wow. School, work, you're, you're a busy guy. And they caught me again already. Still freaking 11 laps to go? Fuck my life. Uh. Wow, Taco, that stinks. <laughs> but yeah, the, uh, the the all the retro schemes at Darlington, I like. I have this big collection of uh, NASCAR diecasts, and. Seeing all those paint schemes, I'm sitting there thinking, I want all of those um, as diecast. I, I want <laughs> to collect them all. They look amazing. Like even like the underfunded teams and stuff like, have some really cool paint jobs this time around. Oh, Junior, I cannot get rid of these guys. It's really annoying. Put the bumper to him. Pretend I'm Dale Senior again. Although he probably wouldn't have done that to Jimmy. <laughs> hey, who cares? Jeff's rattled a few cages in his time too. Freaking yeah, gosh dang you guys. I get rid of one of you and then the next one's on me. Throwback paint scheme in Thunder Road 3 for Darlington. I could, yeah. Um, obviously, I don't know when Darlington's going to be for me. Oh, that brought a caution out. Great. Well, that'll lead up a, a couple laps, I guess. There's some differences between handball and everything. Handball, you throw a ball against a wall back and forth. That's about it. It's a different kind of game. Yeah, yeah, those are going to be some really cool paint jobs. I'm excited about those. Yeah, no good. But yeah, um, I like with the career mode how you know I'll have the opportunity to change up the paint scheme whenever I want. 
and I'll definitely be doing that, like, every so often, or at least for special races, you know? I do want to figure out, like, what sort of sponsorship we could get. If we get a primary sponsor, then we can't change the paint scheme, obviously. Or I, I guess I should say if we get a full primary sponsor. But I don't think they're going to give us one this early in career mode anyway. Because we haven't won or anything yet. So it's like... Chances of it getting it right away is pretty slim. Um, so yeah, like, sponsors play into my decisions of color schemes and such things. Oh no! No, this is not allowed. Frick you, Mark Martin. Why are you doing this to me? The white flag. I will not lose. Ugh. No. No. I'll ram all of you into the wall to win. Frick all of you. Frick all of you. Shot always wins. <laughs> Uh, uh, I'm gonna support Kyle Busch when Tony Restore retires. Cool. I like Kyle Busch. I'll probably be supporting mostly Martin Truex, though. I feel like he's the, the kind of natural go-to guy. Am I on Legend? No, I'm on uh, the middle one. Hard or whatever. Normal. I don't know what it's called. Calgary, welcome to the stream, by the way. Yeah, I remember, Taco, I remember. But, different set of circumstances. <laughs> Besides, I was like an at, at that almost that entire time. That's why I racked up so many kills that night. I couldn't catch a break the next time, but we did it. Alright. I got the uh, Pepsi and I got it. Ooh, the night race at Rockingham. Cool. I like it. Alright, so what's the last thing I need to do? Um, Lime asked for. Yeah, I'm scrolling up. I'm scrolling up. I'm scrolling up. I'm scrolling up. Jimmy Johnson in Texas. Jimmy Johnson in Texas. Yeah, I don't know. It was kind of weird. They definitely ran me down fast, but yeah. Alright, cool. Jimmy Johnson at Texas, and we will... I know, my memory's terrible, I'm sorry. But I got there in the end. Uh, you want Lowe's or Looney Tunes? That's the only two I have. Sorry, Chaz, uh, like I said, he beat you to the punch on asking, and I, I only have one more in me. I'm getting really tired. We'll do it next time. I'll do this again, because you guys really seem to like requesting stuff. Uh, yeah, one more away from the red, white, and blue. Yeah, we'll be getting that soon. Uh, but yeah, Lime, if you, uh, you want regular or Looney Tunes? Looney Tunes, he says. Awesome, thank you. That Twitch delay, I'd, I always forget I need to wait a little longer. And it's Texas. I wish I had Oh, there's a night one. There's a road course. That's right. Mario Kart 8 or Smash tomorrow. Um, I would if Justin was going to be able to do it, but I think he's busy the rest of the week. Um, and I need to catch up on my other recordings. I have a bunch of Mario Kart 8 stockpiled. I'll let you know. If, if it's a possibility, I'll let you know. But I... These last couple days, I haven't been able to record anything, so it's, I need to get some stuff done. Okay. I'm not going to mess with that tire pressure. That seems to keep screwing me over, so um, let's go ahead and uh, do one down on that. No, not the fault. Do this, do this, and let's see how that treats us. But yeah, I've just come to basically embrace the fact that a lot of you guys are just absolutely crazy about NASCAR and racing games, and that's why I, I branched out and did that, that new channel that's just going to be all racing all the time, because I need to still have some diversity on this channel, but at the same time, like I say, you guys want your racing, so this way everybody gets what they want. <laughs> I got a bad start there. 
Freaking Todd Bodine. I don't know why. I always have so much trouble with him. Like, I remember in past career modes, like... Like, there's no, like, rivalries in this game, but he always seemed to be causing me trouble. Like, seriously. Like, frick that guy. Oh, man. This caused a little bit of a mess there, but hey, who cares? I got, like, revenge on him for something he did to me in career mode years ago. <laughs> Frick him. I'll do that next time, Austin. Like I said, this is going to be the last race for me tonight. I'm really tired. Had a hard couple of days. Glad I was able to get a regular stream in for you guys tonight, but it's definitely two hour stream is about all I've got in me tonight, and that's what we're already past two hours. So. Alright. Car isn't perfect, but I, I I can feel like as long as I don't overdrive the corner, it feels pretty good. So I think I can I can work with it. Just everybody's so bunched up right now. It's hard to make any real headway. Hey. You guys are hanging tough on the outside, too. Uh, Elliot, watch out. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Jeff Burton and John Andretti, eh? Yeah. Uh, I don't really have time to play too much off-camera stuff, Austin, so probably what I'll do is next time we stream this, I'll just start off by doing what you said and getting that, uh, that last paint scheme from Jeff, or that red, white, and blue paint scheme. Anyway. But uh, for now, I, uh, I'm already recording tons of stuff. I don't really have a lot of time for off-screen work, except for like in Minecraft where I have to do it. <laughs> but, um... Like I said earlier, I do like YouTube related stuff. Recording, editing, rendering, uploading, or streaming. Like 14 hours a day. <laughs> There's not a lot of time for off screen stuff. I do it when I can, though. See you later, Jay Nair. Have a good one. Thanks for hanging out. Yep. Oh. Oh gosh dang it, these guys are just hanging tough. Give me an inch, please. Uh, Bert, don't you dare. Mr. McLean warned me about you. Trick you. I remember one year, um, I purposely made him wreck every race because I wanted his Sitgo sponsorship because you know if you have somebody like if they finish last like a whole a whole season or something um, then they can uh, they can retire and if they retire then their primary sponsorship will either be their car leaves will be given to one of the filler guys or a rookie um, or it can be left available for you to pick up as a primary sponsorship, which then turns your car into their car, basically. And so I remember one year I really wanted the Sitco car, and I wrecked him every race so that he would retire and I could get his sponsorship. It was pretty funny. Yeah, I did talk about that. You're right. Yeah, I talked about it during the, one of the videos. It's 4.30 a.m. where you're at, Chaucer? Holy cow. Wait, are you like in England? I forget. I think you said one time. Yeah, that's, that's a long time to take up. Or take up? What am I saying? <laughs> long time to be up watching. So. I don't really get to watch a lot of football. I'll say it. I'll say it because you guys are all going to give me crap if I call it soccer. I don't get a lot of chance to watch that. I keep up with it now and then, like, World Cup time rolls around, but I don't really watch any of the league stuff. I just don't have time for anything, let's be honest about it. But, um, 
Yeah. I played soccer briefly when I was a kid. I was pretty terrible at it. I mean, no, I take that back. I was terrible at certain um, positions. My best position was um, halfback. Uh, the guy in the, in the sort of middle of the field that gathers the ball up and then passes it to the guy who's probably going to score with it, that was usually me. I didn't score, and I was a terrible goalie, so I was better in the middle of the field. <laughs> Uh, middle of the pitch, I'm sorry. Uh, let's see. So I think I can free it up a little more. It's a little tight. Yeah, I'm not going to mess with the tire pressure because that always messes me up. That feels pretty good. We've made decent time, but tires are already wearing out. I think if I uh, have a little, I have a little wiggle room here where I'm not like surrounded by people. Finally, I think I'm gonna do a little better because it's like there for a while these guys were just all on top of me. It's like give me an inch, man. Uh, okay. <sighs> it reminds me, one of these nights I'm gonna do a. Uh, FIFA 98 stream night. After testing it out on the N64 night, I definitely want to mess around with that. So I'm like, make a team and kind of customize it, and trade some players around, and get like the perfect team going and have some fun. It'd be a good time. FIFA 98 is such a good game for, for what it was. ever closer here to the lead. And we're into the lead. Now, will we pull away? Probably not, because the rubber banding is so real right now in this game. <laughs> That's a little sideways. Yeah, I know, I know that for sure. It's just this car is feeling pretty tight. I mean, it's not too bad, I guess, but it's just enough that I'm... I always notice, like, if I start, like, cramping up my hand, trying to make it turn just a little more, even though my control stick isn't going to go any further to the left. That's when I usually know it's, it's tight, is because like, I'm gripping the control stick so tightly right now. But, yeah. <laughs> yeah, they. That's funny. I didn't notice that, but yeah, I didn't think about that. But yeah, they both have their Looney Tune schemes on. Uh, oh, caution! Really? <sighs> that's frustrating because I don't, I don't know if they'll be trapped a lap down or not. No, they're getting off pit road. No, they're not actually. Some of them will be a trap line. Will the pace car trap the rest? Maybe. Maybe not. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I see what happened. Biff got Jack side. Who the frick hit him anyway? Let's see that again. He made contact with I think it was Casey Kane. He can come on the pit road. Interesting. Well, we definitely have to pit. <laughs> This was earlier than I wanted to. We should be all right. Uh, all this football chatter. I have no clue what most of you're talking. Uh, Bump with Jeff Gordon there. That was funny. 
But yeah, I noticed that the car like, wigged out there for a second, didn't it? Uh, there's the other one. Jim's car right behind us. Oh, did he drive that into D? He did. He clipped that apron and almost wrecked. Good save by Jeff there. What kind of just come screaming back at me? Actually, that makes me wonder. So I need to check something in the settings because I had my like custom difficulty on. I can't remember. I might have had that set to where they. I think there's a way that you can change the settings so that they. Um, catch back up basically and I'll bet that's what's happening because it seems like such a rubber band effect like I get out in front of them and then they just drive right back to me I'll bet that's what it is because I think this game had that hmm but yeah um so another caution well it'll get rid of all these lap cars at least, or these guys that are in the tail end or whatever. Um, so yeah, I did mention, I guess, I oh, that's why there's caution debris. But, um, NASCAR 2005, my uh, career mode LP on that other channel, it will be continuing in the future after the NASCAR 07 miniseries has run its course. Um, NASCAR 2005 will be back. So for those of you excited about that game, or wondering why I never finished it. Now you don't have to wonder because I will be finishing it. Or at least continuing it. Finishing it will entail many, many seasons in the future and who knows what will happen. But, <laughs> hoping for the best. Okay, maybe I'm thinking about a different game. I know one of the games has, a, has an option where you can make it so that they keep up or whatever. Maybe that's a different game. I don't know. Oh, Jay's the leader. Those two guys are, la are on the tail end of the lap right there. Okay. TJ up there trying to lead with no hood. That's funny. Through the grass. Got seven laps to go. We're going to be fine on fuel. Hopefully the tires don't wear out too much. I'd love to like pull away from these guys, but that does just does not seem to be happening tonight. I can't get away from these guys. Really annoying me. I did not mean to get on the apron there. Ugh. Car keeps turning more than I actually want it to. Definitely a little freer than it was. So I have to kind of. I got this. It's still a little tight though. It's like tied in loose off a little bit now. Okay though. Just have to block like crazy because they're going to keep getting big runs at me. A big wreck. Oh, the 28 is not on the lead lap. It really doesn't matter if he passes me. Alright, we'll go ahead then. Since you seem so fired up to freaking do, so go ahead. Oh, now you don't want to go? So anxious to get by me, won't wreck me. Yeah, that that's true. Oh god. Eh, 
Dale Earnhardt Seniors up here. All of a sudden. Who, who is in, oh, he's the one in second. Uh oh. That's, that's terrifying. Oh, ho, ho, that was close. Got Tony Stewart's up here, too. Ooh, white flag. All right, here we go. Here we go. We can do this. Um, well. Oh, this is going to be really hard. Stewart, what? What the frick? Stuart caused this whole thing, I'll have you know. Wow. I did not come down on him either. He just flat took me the frick out. Tony Stewart. Wow. Wow. Oh my gosh. I need. I hope that's on the replay because I really want to see that. That's the one from before. They have it here, maybe? Yeah, wait, nope. That's one I want. He dives off in here. He goes all the way on the apron. And then drives... Oh, come on. There's got to be a better camera angle than that. Maybe this will show me a better camera angle. He drives all the way on the apron. Freak, this game is... Give me a better camera angle. Maybe this one will be better. There. Yep, just drove straight up into me and Earnhardt. And then popped a wheelie and then kept on going to win the race. Uh, I don't... I barely remember to check Discord messages, to be honest. What, what, was it important? Anyway, what a freaking annoying... Wow. Wait... Tony Stewart was a lapped car! <sighs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> wow. Taken out by my favorite driver when he's a lap down and Dale Earnhardt wins. Wow. Uh, these guys, man. Yeah, I know it. It's, oh my god. Alright, well, that is going to be it for me tonight, guys. <laughs> Send me a picture of Corey now as well. Thanks so much for hanging out, watching the stream. I appreciate it, as always. And, uh, yeah. Um, I don't know exactly what I'll be doing tomorrow. We will see how it goes. Um, Justin definitely will not be able to join for another stream for a while. That's why we did that day stream thing. But um, whenever that's a possibility, we'll work it out. But anyway, yeah. <laughs> that's, uh, that's it for tonight. So I will see you guys tomorrow for another stream of day. Thanks for hanging with me for 75 in a row. Crazy. Bye.